We're here at the Ronald McDonald House and joined by the Stubblefield family. We've got Rob, we've got Katie, we've got Elisa, and we are here asking you to give on this Giving Tuesday. Because when you donate to the Ronald McDonald House, especially today, our friends from Private Financial are going to match the donation. So you give $100. It, that goes a long way, and Thrivent's going to make sure it's matched. So please give right now to the number on your screen, 216-301-2090, or you can go online to bit.ly, that's bit.ly, slash Ohio Gives, all lowercase. Let's meet this incredible family. Rob, you know firsthand as a family about the Ronald McDonald House. Boy, what a history you have here. They have been more than gracious to us. We were here, we came in August of 2014, and then they endured us for a little over four years. We came here under very hard and tragic circumstances, and yet what we found here was not just merely a place to stay, but there was welcoming arms, there was camaraderie, there was a support base, and meals, and uh, places to do laundry to kind of function and live life, and we did. They, uh, they, they were home to us for that period of time. Now, Katie is the reason you're here, and like you said, you know, nobody wants to come to a hospital. <coughs> nobody wants to be in a situation that you were in, and you know, a tragic situation needs as much comfort as possible, and they certainly did come to the rescue in that regard, didn't they? Oh, absolutely. 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 They gave us that comfort. They gave us a lot of room to be ourselves, um, and uh, you know, it was just something that was just very welcoming. It was, like I said, it wasn't just some, merely a place to stay and to, to crash and sleep, but really it was home. It literally was home for that period of time for us, and they were more than accommodating and more than understanding. Rob, take us back. How many years are we going back to? This is uh, 2019, so we came here a little over five years ago, and uh, my memory serves me correctly. And so we came here, we actually had come to Cleveland uh, in May of that year. We had transferred from Memphis where Katie was uh, at for the first five weeks after her injury. And then we stayed at a, uh, a relative's apartment in the area, and then they were coming back into town, and uh, the, the Big Mac house, as I refer to it, opened up. And uh, it was uh, an opportunity for us to come. And Katie was across the streets. Uh, she was an inpatient for about 250 some odd days she straight. She was in an accident. The accident happened where you know she was she was injured. Yes. She, she was shot in the face. Yeah, it was a it was a it was a gunshot wound to the face, and so it was a very horrific injury that she had sustained. It was a self-inflicted injury that was in a moment of weakness, mm -hmm. and uh, the first several weeks were kind of balancing between life and death. Not really sure when there was a, a realm of stability. Then she was able to be transferred here. The Cleveland Clinic offered to bring her in with about the potential of a face transplant that we had never heard about before prior to any of this uh, journey. But uh, it's we, it is, it, it's just, it's, it's beyond incredible. fascinating. It is, it's, yeah. it's literally a new lease on life and a, a brand new opportunity. And Katie looks beautiful, yeah. no doubt about it. Yeah. <laughs> and you know, it's, it's wonderful because you have the, the, the normal, if you will, that, that was given you by the Ronald McDonald House, you know firsthand as a family. Uh, like you said, everything that families have to go through, laundry, you know, and worrying about meals, they, they take care of all of that, and that's why it's so important. And I want to point out to everyone watching right now that this institution, the Ronald McDonald House, relies 97% on all of you. It's donation-driven. 97% of what they do is donated corporately and individually that you're watching right now. So that's why on this Giving Tuesday, it's so important that you give, not only for this wonderful family, but there are, I think, 40 families staying here currently right now. Yes, and they're, they're from all over. They're from all over the country, uh, different backgrounds and, and different cultures. Mm -hmm. And that's one of the unique things about being here over that long uh, period of time, yes. that you see all kinds of uh, individuals. Totally, how many years were you here in, in the house? In the house, we came in August of 2014. Sorry, to make the, you did the math, but no, we're no, talking no. like four years. <coughs> four, four years, four months. But, four years, four months. But recently, we are now neighbors with the Ronald McDonald House, correct? Yes, we are. Yes. We, are, we have an apartment in Little Italy right so, so you're out of the house, but you know firsthand how important it is to be in this particular place. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yes, and that's why we're relying on you right now on this Giving Tuesday. Please, the number on your screen, 216 30 one two zero nine zero and of course you can go online to bit.ly slash ohio gives 
this beautiful family just keeps getting better and better. Thank you so much for sharing. Thanks for your hearts. We appreciate Thank it, you. Katie. God bless you. All right, continued good health. All right, we'll send it back to you.